Christ! Oh, you scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take that battery now. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. I'm just kidding. Here you go. What's that? Nothing. You can quit with the act, Molly. I know you're from Crawford. What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. Why'd you lie to me? I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place or their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret, kept her safe for as long as I could, but in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked, how anything was better than becoming one of them, but I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late, before they came and took my sister away. This is all I have left of her. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. She's pretty. What the hell? I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. Jesus! Shit! Man. Sorry, sorry. I just got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. Kenny and I still can't get the door open to the armory. He sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Uh, Ben? Where did you get that? I just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. Oh no. Ah! Shit! Wasn't me! Good going, kid. Nice shot. Thanks. What the fuck is going on? They're coming. Oh shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come on, damn you! This is my fault, all my fault. What the hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? Kenny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. I opened the door. I let them in. Ben, we don't have time for this now. I'm sorry, Lee. I can't do this anymore. He's got a right to know. Know what? It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Duck, it was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the Motor Inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. That's when Duck... <laughs> Kenny, man, I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. I gotta focus on getting out of here. You little pisshead! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dead! My wife 
And child, you got about fucking killed! Kenny, listen to me. You can whip his skin in the last later, but right now we gotta go! Nice group you got here. Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! You hear me, shitbird? You can stay behind and fucking rot! Kenny, I know you're upset. I understand. But you don't get to make a decision like that on your own. We're all in this together. We're a group. Sure, take a vote. This is America. Fuck it. But before you all decide, there's something you ought to know. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's got to get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here. Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to Omi, and you put that at risk. Wait, don't I get a vote? Of course you do. Ben's nice. He's my friend. We don't leave friends behind. That's my vote. On second thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. Lee? I can't do this right now. I abstain. We'll figure this out later. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a say? Now can we go? Damn right. Vernon, come on! <laughs> 